We're staying with that breaking news from earlier this morning. The CHP's on scene of a shooting on a Greyhound bus traveling on the I-5 this morning. 23 ABC's Daniela Garrido has an update from CHP on just how many victims are involved. Daniela? That's right, CHP Fort Tejon confirming there were six victims on that Greyhound bus where a passenger began to fire shots as the bus was going northbound on the I-5. I'm going to move out of the way here to give you a look at that Greyhound bus. Now CHP telling us the driver of the Greyhound bus was actually able to pull out here to this Valero gas station and they tell us there are there were multiple victims but cannot tell us exactly to what extent those injuries are so we don't know if there are any fatalities right now but CHP is calling calling it a stable situation and telling us that and not telling us if there is someone in custody at the moment. Now we do know those initial calls came in around 1:30 this morning and that's when that passenger on the Greyhound bus began to fire shots. That driver of the bus was able to pull out here to this Valero gas station and those victims of the of the shooting were actually transported to a hospital and the rest were picked up by a rescue bus. Now KCSO deputy did call this a crime scene and will continue to give you more more information as it becomes available. But for now, we're live off of the Grapevine Road East. I'm Daniela Garrido, 23ABC News, connecting you.